Don't you feel the sun? <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for being here. Earlier today, I received a message from Mrs. Alita de Klerk informing me about the sad passing of F.W. de Klerk. I expressed my condolences and the government's condolences to herself, the children, as well as the de Klerk family. We are saddened that F.W. de Klerk has passed away. He was 85 years old and had not been well for some time. It saddens us because he did play a key role in ushering in democracy in our country. He was a leader of a, a party that was largely discredited in relation to the role that the National Party played in enforcing apartheid. But he had the courage to step away from the path that his party that he led had embarked upon from 1948. And we will remember him for that. And of course, the policies that the apartheid regime espoused and implemented have wreaked a lot of havoc on millions and millions of South Africans. And it was the havoc that many of our people will never forget and have suffered from. But as a human being, it is important for us as South Africans to pay our condolences and to allow him to go and rest because he was not well uh, towards the end. And it is in this regard that our hearts are with the de Klerk family, with uh, Mrs. Elita de Klerk. And I'd like to say that we will wait for the F.W. de Klerk Foundation to tell us about the details uh, of his funeral and what they have in mind. And as government, we stand ready, as always, to work with uh, the Clerk family, as well as with his foundation. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.